Hey everyone, it's been a little bit. Uh, welcome back to Bangers and Beans, though. A lot's been going on at work these past couple days. Shows are being piled on to me, so I haven't really had much time to make anything. But you know what? We're back now, and I feel great about it. Let's talk about today's artist. Today's artist is AU, and I actually met AU in a lobby one time when we kind of bonded over wine, since we're both into tasting and things like that, and when he reached out to me to make a video, I was super excited to put him on. Oh, and by the way, the song you're listening to is called Be With You, and it's spelled Y-U, not Y-O-U. Get it? Well, let's get into today's drink. AU wanted me to make him an Americano. And I love Americanos, and it's such a simple drink. It's just espresso and hot water, but it has such a rich history behind it. Back in World War II, when the Americans were fighting alongside their European allies, they would be in the trenches, and the way they would make coffee was by a thing called a mocha pot. And it makes essentially what is espresso, and it's really, really strong on its own. And Americans weren't exactly attuned to that kind of taste. They preferred a much more mild coffee like you would get out of a regular old coffee pot. So what they would do in the trenches is they would make the espresso with the mocha pot and then they would add water to it. And it turned out it was actually really good. And everyone started drinking Americanos, thus the name Americano. So for today's recipe, I used 17.6 grams of coffee and I am pulling I believe it was about 28 grams of water out. It might have been a little more, it was 28 to 35. We're gonna add more water to it later on, but I was using a natural process Colombian bean. So it had a lot of really cool fruit notes. And the water, the hot water I add is not too hot. It's just hot enough, about 78 degrees Celsius. And you just fill your cup up, add a little spoon so you can stir. And as you admire your beautiful Americano, leave a comment on the video. Let me know who I should feature next. Cheers, y'all.